birthday morning, guys. Just a little heads up. I did not end yesterday's vlog because me and Dale got in an argument and I just wanted to go to bed. I ended up sleeping on the couch. Yeah, it was stupid, really. I mean, it was about those stupid cigarettes. I hate those cigarettes. I just hate them. It wasn't really so much about the cigarettes. It was the fact that he lied to me. That's what made me mad. Um, <laughs> I had given him um, the money for our camping trip. And I asked him, I was like, did you give it to the guy? And he was like, no. And I'm like, why not? Like, why did you give it to him? And he's like, because I was short $5. And I was like, okay. Yeah. And earlier he had some change in his pocket. And he was like taking it out, putting it in his little change cup. And I asked him where he got it. And he said, oh, I found it in the work truck. And I was like, okay, well, maybe, you know, somebody was saving that. But if not, you know, great. Congrats to you. So he lied to me. That change was from breaking a tin and getting a pack of cigarettes. Now, I know there's people out there, and I know that they smoke, and some people don't see anything wrong with it. You know, fine and dandy, but I have a problem with it, mainly because it costs money, which, I mean, you're just throwing away. For two, he's going outside, ignoring me. For three, it stinks, and it makes your breath smell really bad. I don't care if you brush your teeth, it makes it smell bad. And like when you're singing in church, you get a whiff of that, and it's just like, yeah. <laughs> um, four, I mean, it can kill you. You know, I mean, it just like, I mean, I, I thank you for not smoking around me or the kids. Yeah, thank you. But still, you know, if you smoke, you have it on your clothes, you have it on your hands. I mean, like, anyways, but fact of the matter was we were in an argument because he lied to me and I was upset because he lied to me he looked me in the eye and lied to me so I was really upset about that I was pretty upset so we ended up having some words and I ended up sleeping on the couch for like half the night until what sounded like yeah what sounded like somebody tried to open the front door but I think it was just the wind um blowing real hard and I was like, who that? <laughs> so I just like got up, grabbed my pillow, went back there to my bed. Riley, uh, I guess he come in here sometime when I was asleep and slept on the love seat. And he wasn't too far behind me. So, yeah, this morning we were still kind of like, you know, I'm not speaking. And then like 30 minutes after I took him to work, he, he had texted me. And he was like, I'm sorry, I lied to you. I won't do it again. I'm like, that's right. You won't do it again. <laughs> so... Anyway, it's just normal stuff, nothing too serious, but I'm about to read um, my Bible verse for the day, finish my coffee, um, and hopefully get my day started. Stop it. You can't ever do something. <laughs> it's just like, it totally makes you laugh. Friley was over there, and he was getting a marker. Well, he was getting a pencil. He had a pencil at first that he broke the lead on, and he was so upset because he broke the lead. And he was showing me, he was like, ah! Oh! Mom! And I was like, let me see. And I was like, uh-oh. So he went back there to get a pencil out of that little tin right there. And he was standing right there. And so he was taking out, like, pens and pencils in there. And so he held up this red marker. And I said, mm-mm. And he goes, he puts it back. He holds up a pencil. And I said, and he says, mm, mm Puts it back. Holds up a pen. And I said, okay. He puts it back. And then he grabs this little bitty marker that he has right here. That I have no idea where it came from. And he pulled it out, and I said, uh-uh. And he goes, and he starts smiling, and he puts the can back. I don't like him to have markers, because sometimes he accidentally marks on things, such as the self, the furniture, the wall, the floor. Yeah, I mean, not my first rodeo, but it was just the funniest thing. I couldn't help but laugh, and I didn't want to, like, get up and be mean and take it from him, because it was, like, yeah. made me think of, like, um, Goldilocks. <laughs> He was looking for the right pen, and he found the one that was just right. Now he's coloring on every page in the book. Are you making a masterpiece? Huh? What are you drawing? Something that looks like a potato or a shoe? I'm not sure. What is it? Oh my. Write your name. Yes. That's your name? Ooh, 
look at your signature. So fancy. So fancy. I've got like the saddest thing. So like last night, or it might have been this morning. So anyways, somehow this one drug Hulk, the action figure, on my coffee table. Yeah. So it's kind of hard to see, but there's little like... Maybe you guys can see it. There's little lines of where he walked around the coffee table and drug it on there. Yeah. I sat down and I was like, I was looking at my coffee table and I said, what the heck? And then one of the older boys told me that he did that. And I was like, so I'm kind of like, do I repaint it or should I just like put a gloss on it and just let it be? I'm thinking I'm probably just going to put a gloss on it and just let it be because it'd be too hard to try to repaint this and duplicate everything. So, thinking maybe the gloss will kind of sort of hide it. Hey, put a lid on that. I don't know. Kind of sad though. I'm in lunch a little bit early just because I'm hungry. My cereal didn't last long at all. We've been eating the heck out of some cinnamon toast crunch. Mm. Yeah, and then like I'm trying to play like this mind trick. I'm like... Because I read with PCOS that if like cinnamon is good for you and stuff like that. And so I'm like, well, it's got cinnamon in it. Yeah, and like, buku sugar. But, yeah, anyways. I painted my nails, my new um, color that came in my Ipsy bag. I'm not sure how I feel about it. It's like this, like, bluish, lavender, gray. And yeah, I still got to clean up around the edges. I've told you guys that though. But if you're not, if you don't paint your nails like perfectly, don't worry about it. Let it fully dry in the bathtub. All that stuff just comes right off. You don't even have to take the time to put glue or whatever they do on those little videos around there. Yeah, whatever. So, because then, you know, if you put glue and it like seeps into there and you go to take it off or whatever, it takes off the nail polish. It takes off your nail polish, so it still looks really jacked up anyways. But... Anywho, I'm not sure how I feel about this color. It's just something different, so I was like, hey, why not? But I got a big headache after painting my nails. So, and I've, you know, I've painted my nails for years and years, but this one really gave me a big headache. So, be cautious of that. But I have been working on the vlog. Um, it is uploading right now. I think it's like half done. And so I'm going to go ahead and try to edit um, one of my other videos to get that up, but I decided to take a break and make me some lunch and make Riley some lunch. He refuses to sit with me, so he's sitting in there eating a hot dog, watching Scooby-Doo. But I'm having leftovers from last night. A big heaping um, helping of those raviolis with garlic bread. It's good too, with a little bit of um, Italian style cheese on there. Those are really good. I hadn't tried those. I tried, what was it, like Bertoli? Um, the raviolis from them, and those are pretty good, but, um, I mean, these great value ones are really good, and they're, like, half the price. So, really, really yummy, but I'm kind of, like, overeating today just because I've kind of been, like, in one of those moods where everything annoys me. I'm still kind of ticked about the whole Dale situation. Yeah. You guys know what I mean. It's just the fact that he lied to my face. Okay? I, I wouldn't have been so upset if he had just told me the truth right then and there and then it's like I probably would have been upset but I wouldn't have been as upset I would have been like oh Dale you know what I've told you about those let it go no 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 the fact that he stood there and was like oh I found some change in the truck it you know work yeah because then it makes me it, like in my brain and you girls know what I'm talking about you ladies know what I'm talking about and my brain's like, okay, well, if you lie about this little small little thing, what else are you lying about? Like, I thought we had kind of gotten, like, over that and past all of that childish crap. And then it's, like, I don't know. And then it makes me wonder about stuff. And then it's like, maybe we hadn't gotten past that. Maybe he's playing me. He could be playing me. And if he's playing me, you don't even want to know. Anyways, I want to eat my lunch because I'm starting to talk crazy stuff. So I'm like, obviously, really hungry. So I'm going to eat that and see what the kids doing in the fridge. Okay, tonight on the menu is hamburger steaks with some brown gravy, some mashed potatoes, broccoli with um, some cheese sauce. It's going to be super duper pretty good. So I have my stuff going on over here. 
I have my hamburger patties in the skillet here. I just season them up with some salt and then this uh, Mrs. Dash onion and herb seasoning uh, and threw some onions on top of it. I've already flipped them over. I like to throw the onions, um, the onions, <laughs> the onions in after um, one side of them is already um, browned up nicely. That way, by the time that they're done cooking, they're not just mush, so or burnt because sometimes they get burnt. But um, I'm just gonna let those finish cooking. I have my water back here with a um, sprinkle of the garlic and herb, Mrs. Dash, with some butter and a pinch of salt. Potatoes cut up with some butter and a pinch of salt. They're coming to a boil and I turn my fan on. All this heat. Um, I have the cheese cut up over here, just Velveeta cheese and some broccoli, just frozen broccoli. Quick and easy. Um, and then the brown gravy is just out of the pocket. So. Quick and easy though, Adele's in the shower. Um, getting all nice and cleaned up. Brody's laying over here at the table. He's got a whole setup going on. I think he really likes those dominoes, you know, when they lay them out like that and, no, dominoes, and knock them down. He does this a lot, actually. Preston is over here making some changes to his binder because, well, it keeps, as he calls it, exploding. He'll open it up or he'll drop it and all his papers just fly out. They need some bigger binders. Um, I had to get this one. Um, this is like the... Oh, you got your day's belt. This is like a one inch binder. They need some of those good tough ones. Like the old um, They're like, they're cloth and rubber and they have a zipper. I cannot think of what they're no, called. No, no zipper. How about the Velcro? The Velcro you just got. Or Velcro, but. No, zipper is great and you will like. Picky, picky. Hey, get that off my coffee table, dude. Drinking um, Sunny D. I, I see. Thank you. I don't want the. Yeah, well, you drank it, but don't put it on my coffee table. Daniel's reading a book. What book are you reading? Oh, hey. Cool it. He is, like, going through some terrible threes, like, some kind of bad. Really, like, bad, terrible threes. He, past couple days, he has been a heathen. Man, I cannot tell you how bad he has been. He, he's been bad, though. He's... He's testing my nerves. He's working on it. So, working on it like his daddy is. <laughs> Del, <laughs> this morning, I'm gonna, I'll insert the picture, but this morning, Del asked me, I'd already made it, and he said, will you make me some iced coffee? Like the brew to set up in the fridge, which is you take like half a cup of coffee grounds, and you dump it over into a big uh, mason jar, and you put, you fill it up with water, and you let it sit for like eight hours or so, and then you'll dump it through, um, like a coffee filter or some cheese, um, like mesh, and um, or cheesecloth. That's what it is. And uh, anyways, you'll have iced coffee. You put it over ice. You can add cream, some sugar, whatever. So anyway, he asked me if I would make him some. So I was still in that like, you know, ticked off mood. Um. So anyways, hold on. Um, I'll, I'll record it in a second. So anyways, that's all the that I already made it, and I was like, this one is sure to be a pleaser, and so I had a box of children's x like sitting behind it. I'll put the picture in. He was like, did you really put that in my coffee? <laughs> of course not. Okay. okay, they want me to let you guys see this. Alright, go. Wow! Okay, Brady. Make sure we say name prayer. Amen. That's not how you Amen. That was very short, but um. Anyways, here is our dinner: hamburger steak with gravy and onions, mashed potatoes with some of the gravy on top, broccoli with cheese looks really good and it tastes really good too it oh obviously tastes pretty good because he's eating his up did you eat your broccoli with cheese i made you broccoli mm -hmm. mm. riley is in my again but not this yet over there. not this yet yeah he's over there playing with the me and watching tv mm. preston how is yours excellent mm. daniel good thumbs up must be. yeah he said he was starving mm -hmm. Looks like he's tired. Aren't we all? 
you're getting better, bud. <laughs> yeah, your cough sounds a lot better. Doesn't sound like it's wet. Yummy! Sounds like it's drying up. This is good. Uh, what, the hamburger steak? Mm -hmm. Good. Okay. You get what now? Well, try to eat and then you can go to bed. Oh, it must be good. Dale's eating it, so. No, I love the broccoli and cheese. He's not passed them out, so. Not yet. We need some cauliflower with some ranch. Like that too. He'll pass out tomorrow when he has a second cup of coffee. Mm -hmm. Anyways, so I'm going to go ahead and eat my dinner before it gets cold, though. I washed my hair. I'm going to put this paint back. And to see if my board that I'm painting over here is dry. I'm painting it orange. I'm in a dark corner, so it's hard to see. But I'm painting it orange. And I'm thinking about writing the word um, either harvest or like give thanks or something like that on this board. But I don't know yet. That's for another project. I just finished straightening my hair. <sighs> so so sad. It was coming out in like handfuls. Like I was like washing it in the shower and stuff. And when I was brushing it, just handfuls. <sighs> that sucks. It just stinks. Like, really, really bad. I feel so soft right now, though. I went ahead and um, put that um, Mark Anthony um, oil in it. I think it's like Moroccan oil or Moroc Moroccan? Anyways, oil in my hair. And I like to take it and, like, rub it through. And I do that with when I wash and um, condition my hair. I'll take it and I'll take my hands and, like, rub it like that um, through the ends of it. So anyways, I brushed it and I went ahead and um, I did blow dry it and then I straightened it just so it's already done and I can wear it like this for a few days and shouldn't have to worry with it. So it feels so nice and soft, I can't stop touching it. It is, it's getting pretty long. I can't decide if I want to get bangs or not. I don't know. Part of me is kind of like, yeah, get some bangs, like some side swept bangs, like imagine me with bangs like this. <laughs> Where? Put this over here. Imagine me with things like that. I'm not sure. And then the other part of me is like, no, don't get bangs. I don't know. Who knows? I'm wearing my Breakfast Club shirt tonight. Oh yeah, I got this on clearance uh, a little while back. I'm wearing that to bed. I'm getting ready to go get these chitlins. Ooh, dark. In bed, they're playing ABC Mouse, but I'm ready to go lay down and finish watching the Adams Family. What are you doing? He's got on a big old shirt trying to jump to the computer. I don't, yeah. You're gonna fall. Totally. Anyways, but uh, nothing interesting has happened today or this evening, so yeah. <laughs> oh well. That's okay though. I'm gonna go ahead and say goodnight though. So I'll see you guys tomorrow kick off for a weekend doing I have no idea what but it at least it's the weekend <laughs> I've already done Monday Tuesday can I collect $200 and go straight to Friday <laughs> anyways but can I guys I'll see you tomorrow